Yeah, I think I look better from a down angle, but I certainly look better than you. Just kidding. Anyways, my lighting in here is a little better than your lighting in there. Plus, the, the iPhone is kind of an amazing contraption. Amazing video quality for such a small device. This is the low resolution camera on the front, but it's certainly impressive. But your point is well taken. Not that there was much of a point to be made, just an observation on your part. Thank you for the advice. I was thinking about camera angles a little like that. The problem is I am using the iPhone, so it makes it a little more uh, technically challenging. I uh, hope you like the special effects. What special effects? I haven't decided what special effects yet. Okay, this is a front-facing camera. I decided to give you a little bit of a front-facing view, kind of the house. Kind of what's going on right now in this cluttered environment of mine. There's the birds. But uh, you can try to check out the resolution. Anyways, transition. Well, it's not 40 below zero here. As you can see in the background, there's trees. They don't look good. There's no snow on the ground. I'll give you a front view in a second, but I wanted to just tell you, no, I just thought when you didn't respond, you had better things to do. Video blogging is kind of crazy. However, it works for what it's worth. And we'll do another transition here. This is a hole in the ground. Now, you might be asking, okay, why is he showing me a hole in the ground? This is a cheap alternative to a jungle gym. This is what my son will tell me in the future. he say, no, my bad dad didn't buy me a jungle gym. What he did was he dug a hole in the ground and said, have fun. So anyways, this is Zane's ground. Over there is Sadie looking at me saying, what the hell are you doing? And this is the back of the house. And there's a stump. Not that you care. But this is all done from a single device. Yes, it's the Apple version of a smartphone. I like to refer to them as handheld computers. But it works well and pretty good battery life and those sorts of things. So you can do this sort of video blogging on the fly. Why I tell you this, I don't know. Something to tell, tell you. Anyways, it just made me think about the future and fear factor. One of the reasons I'm even looking at video blogging is just the tendency of fear. Fear to do facial presentations. Writing is sort of a um, less, less personal in a way. Not in a way, it is just less personal. So that's why I think video blogging something to make you think about. So what? So what if someone thinks I'm crazy? So what if someone thinks this is a bad idea? Um, seen some kids doing it rightly point out that it is a sort of a kiddie thing to do, but um, I also think it's a good uh, alternative way to communicate. You know, my letters can be rather hard to read and very hard for me to write, and so maybe this is more difficult. I have no idea, but it is an alternative form of communication. And so you can walk around holding this handheld device, getting a pretty good Sure. And like you pointed out, angle is something you work on. Maybe the head thing goes hang out the picture. Or a helmet, helmet with a little hoopy on it, something like that. But um, it's, it's sort of an interesting um, background, right? When I'm walking around, so you see the background something around there. But it, it's amazing how well our hand tracks to our face. Our hand doesn't move; it stays in line with our face naturally. I'm trying to think, my hand has to be moving, right? But my body is moving, so it's a rigid body. Anyways, it is kind of a classic background thing I see a lot now in video bloggers. And the thought of getting better angles and working with lighting and props and those sorts of things has occurred to me. But one of the aspects that I'm sort of playing around with is just trying to do it as simply as possible. A single device with an Android phone or an iPhone. I actually have an An Android. I haven't really played with it because I enjoy working with this one more. So, anyways, that's what I'm up to. And I uh, thought I'd just sort of play with a video blog as 
generally I need to do. So I'm using you as a guinea pig. Comments, criticisms, observations, all that is welcome and encouraged as always. Thanks, Tom, for listening. Bye.